Hello, today we are going to learn how to draw a rectangle given its diameter d and the length of one of its sides a. So to do this we draw a line at the bottom half of our screen as shown here. And we put a vertex on one end of the line which we will call A. And now setting our compass to the length of the given diameter D, we're going to transport this onto our line. So setting the compass on vertex A, we scribe an arc. To obtain our second vertex, which we will call C. The next thing, we are going to do is work out the perpendicular bisector of the diagonal D. To do this, setting our compass to a little more than half the radius, we scribe an arc above and below the line. And again, with the same radius, setting our compass on vertex C, we scribe an arc above and below the line until it cuts our previously drawn arc at, the, at two places. And now we join these two intersections to locate the midpoint of the line, which we will call M, with capital M, as can be seen here. So now, setting our compass on point midpoint M, and with radius MC or MA, we're going to draw a circle, as can be seen here. The next step, setting our compass to the length of the given side A. Now we're going to transport this line. So setting the compass on vertex A, we scribe an arc above until it cuts the previously drawn circle at our third vertex of the rectangle that we're going to draw. And now with the same radius, setting the compass on vertex C, we're going to scribe an arc below the line until it cuts our previously drawn circle at the fourth vertex of our rectangle. So now we have A, vertex A, B, C, and D. So finally, we are going to join the four vertices, vertex A, to vertex B in a thicker line, as can be seen here. Next from vertex B to vertex C. Now vertex C to vertex D. And finally, we complete our rectangle, joining vertex D to vertex A. So if we have been working with precision and accuracy, we're just going to check the angles for 90 degrees, angle D, and vertex B also. So we're going to mark vertex B and D with the symbol of perpendicularity for 90 degrees and we name the opposite sides BB and AA as can be seen in the rectangle. Okay, I hope this video has helped you. Please press like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you. Until the next time.